What's up guys, it's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video you're going to learn how to properly set up and configure the WP Rocket, the best catch and website optimization or performance WordPress plugin in a simple, fast and effective method, okay? So I'm going to start at the point that you already go to our WordPress dashboard plugins, add new, upload plugin and he did install the plugin on your site, okay? After this, you're going to be able to see into your WordPress left sidebar of menus, hover your mouse over settings and go to WP Rocket. This is a cache plugin that can make wonders for your site performance, optimization, score, for example, GT metrics or Google Page Speed Insights, okay? So, having a faster site can make you do more sales, give a more engagement, make your user spend more time on your site, okay? And improve the... the CTR. Okay, so let's learn how to do this. Go to this dashboard right here and the very first thing to do is navigate to the cache tab into this left sidebar of menus on WP Rocket and we would like to speed up your site for mobile visitors. So enable caching for mobile devices. Separate cache files for mobile devices. This is not important, most of the teams already have it, so nothing to do right here. Just select the first options. User cache, this is not needed, okay? This only gonna help if you have a lot of users on your site, but if not, I prefer that this does not happen. And this is a very important part, cache life spin or life time. So, enable preloading for the cache to be rebuilt automatically. So specific time after which the global cache is cleaned. You can change for hours and days and you can have it in, for example, 10 days or leave at zero for unlimited. This is up to you. I recommend that you give a big number right here or leave at zero and save your change, okay? After this, let's go to file optimization, a very, very important thing to optimize your site. The very first thing to do is minify CSS files. This is up to your team, okay? But most of the sites won't be affected if you enable this option. But of course, it's always good to test. Combine CSS files, enable minify CSS files to select. This also can help because if you activate this, the, this cache plugin is gonna be able to combine files in order to create an easier to, lead, to read and faster to load files, okay? After this, we have another option, optimize CSS delivery. This could break things. If you not see any errors on your site after activating these settings, just deactivate it, okay? So it's up to you once again, but really, really important. We can remove and use a CSS or load CSS in another and more modern way. It's up to you, but I recommend that you keep this active. Then we have JavaScript files, okay? Minify Java. It's really, really important. Combine once again, depends on your team, but good to try. If nothing breaks on your site, keep it enabled because it's going to optimize your site. Load Java. Defer it is, is really, really important to enable and delay Java execution, okay? This gonna be, this gonna make the, the scripts to be delayed. However, if you activate this, you may want to apply some, some exceptions, some exclusions, okay? Because Google AdSense, Google Analytics, Google Maps and other parts and very, very important things on your site need this to work, okay? So, if you do, are not worried in optimize every single step, I recommend you to not mark this option. So, save change. Let's go to the media, another very important part. Enable the lazy load. This is very, very important. Enable for iframes and videos. Very, very important as well. And add missing image dimensions. This helps a lot to optimize the image and Google loves it. Okay, so keep this enabled and move to the next one. Preload cache. So you enable preloading, WP Rocket will automatically detect your sitemap and save all the URLs to database. This plugin will make sure that your cache is always preloaded. Really, 
really important, okay? Because every single page of your site on the sitemap gonna be preloaded, so gonna be loaded faster. Preload links. Links preload improves the perceived load time. So if you enable this, you're gonna be able to Imagine that you, the user is on your home page, and on your home page you have a button to your contact page. Imagine that this button have a link, and if you enable this option, the WP Rocket gonna be able to preload the links. Okay, so very very interesting. Nothing else to do right here. Just save change. There's other parts right here ears, phones to preload and other things, most of the users won't use this, okay? So no need to worry. With all of those settings, you already have made a great progress. You can set some URLs to never be cached, okay? For example, account page, cart page, checkout page on your shop, okay? Apply the links right here. Database. So. Post cleanup, you can clean up the revisions, the auto draft, and the trashed posts. You can clean up comments on spam and trashed comments as well. And you can transcript, okay, you can clean up this. You can optimize the tables in the case that you want and automatic clean up. So you can set that once a month the cleanup be made, okay? This can make your site occupates less space on your server and be loaded faster as well, okay? What else we can do? In the case that you're using some content delivery network, for example, um, something like um, CDN, for example, the Cloudflare, you can load it right here, okay? You can enter with your key, your names, but if not, you can jump this step. The heartbeat, this is really, really important. Click right here to control heartbeat. This is a native WordPress function that can slow down your site. So click it right here and save your chains. We have some add-ons and right here we're gonna be able to find other very nice options. For example, the Vanish. WebP compatibility, this is really, really important. Improve browser compatibility for WebP image. In the case that you have a plugin right here, you can integrate the Cloudflare account in this section as well, okay? If we enable this option or the security option, okay? Both are firewalls and CDNs, okay? Good for performance if you have, but if not yet, I recommend that you just jump this is part and finally we have this option right here for image optimization nothing to do right here okay and we have the tools okay we can export settings import settings roll back and you have some tutorials from the plugin developers that can help you a lot as well but nothing else to do if you do all of those settings just like i did in this video your site gonna be really really faster and everyone gonna love gonna loves how speed this is gonna load okay and that is hope you guys enjoyed this video feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question don't forget to check out our borderless wordpress plugin to gain widgets elements templates and tools to build up your site using element or gutenberg or Enzu WordPress team, the best free WordPress team that you can install on your site in order to customize it in the way that you want, or growth.net platform, growth of three Ws, a place where you can submit your site for receiving and publishing guest posts, and or visualmoto.com in the case that you want to go premium. Go to visualmoto.com, purchase the Visual Moto Pass and unlock access to our full templates library that is a big and massive collection with hundreds of pre-built websites that you can import with a single click and start with a red website from the beginning, including with some icons, templates, widgets, blocks, support and many many more pro features in order to create the site of our dreams. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. All the best.